Make a quarter turn clockwise. Recall that clockwise means the same direction that the hands on a clock move. A quarter is one part in four equal parts. Let's colour one quarter of this circle. To turn the pencil one quarter turn clockwise, we start at this point, turn in this direction, and finish at this point here. Let's try it with the pencil. We have turned the pencil one quarter turn clockwise. Make a half turn anti clockwise. Recall that anti clockwise means the opposite direction that the hands on a clock move. Half is one of two equal parts. Let's colour half of this circle. To turn the eraser half a turn anti clockwise, we start at this point, turn in this direction, and finish at this point here. We have turned the eraser half a turn anti clockwise. Make a three quarter turn clockwise. The turn will follow the direction of the hands on a clock. Three quarters is three out of four equal parts. The circle is divided into four equal parts. To turn three quarters clockwise, we can start here. And finish here. Can you guess how the fish will look after we turn it? We have turned the fish three quarters clockwise. Did you guess correctly? Make a full turn anti clockwise. Can you guess the position of the penguin after this turn? Anti clockwise means we turn in this direction. A full turn means we turn in a complete circle. We finish at the same point we started. We have turned the penguin a full turn anti clockwise. It is back in the same position.